Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, wherever you may be. Uh, CC here, Chris, from New York, uh, Westchester County. It's December 6th, uh, 2019. Uh, a couple things I want to share with you today. Um, well, this one's for Google. Uh, it, a turkey recipe. Um, I'm actually celebrating Thanksgiving with my parents tomorrow. And uh, because they were unable to come down last weekend. Anyway, my turkey recipe is one of the best turkey recipes you'll ever have. I think, personally. What I like to do is I like to get, well, there's five people, and I like to get a 10-pound bird. Um, now, preferably, I'd like to buy a fresh one, but we're after the holiday season for Thanksgiving, so none of the, everybody's out of fresh turkeys. you got to order it. You're shit out of luck if you haven't put the order in on Monday, because it won't show up until Saturday. <laughs> and uh, tomorrow's Saturday, so I had to get a frozen one. It's thawing out in my refrigerator. To quicken the thawing process, what I like to do is take the bird, put it in the sink with ice water. Make sure it's ice cold. Ice water should do it. And uh, let it sit for 45 minutes, maybe an hour. It'll start the thawing process quicker. Back to Flat Earth. All right, guys. Here we are, talking about Flat Earth. Once again. Once again, it's the biggest topic of everybody. Most people can't even touch it. <laughs> they can't even touch it. They won't. They won't. They won't admit that the sun is not 93 million miles away, that it can't possibly be that fucking far away. Okay? It doesn't make any sense. The shadows don't show. Oh, but wait a minute. They did a test with um, a, a Greek uh, guy. I should know what his name is. Um, did a test, you know, with, with sticks. That's, that's your test to say that we live on a curve. Okay. That no. That that actually proves even more the fact that one, the sun is not as big as they say it is. That it's local. It's probably only seventy miles large. Maybe a hundred, if that. If that. Um. Anyway, so just going back. That's some proofs of, of a globe Earth, you know, and 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 the curvature and, and uh, of of the. Uh, lasers, you know, they, they can't match the lasers up that they did on the, uh, on the, whatever, uh, on the history channel, whatever it is. And we all know that was fake and it was propped back to Thanksgiving recipe. So anyway, what I like to do is after the birds thaw it out, what I like to do is I like to take the bird and dry it, of course. They tell you not to clean the bird because all the juices will get all over the place now. You know, that's that's new this year. Well, I think they said that last year, too. Fuck it. Clean the bird, okay? Just make sure you're not an animal and you don't turn the fucking faucet on high, okay? Don't do it! <laughs> Keep it low, and it won't splash all over the place. Fucking common sense! Sorry, guys. We're gonna have to rate this uh, R for the Thanksgiving recipe, too. Uh, so I, I like to take the skin and take it, you know, open it up a little bit and form a cavity. Okay, this is where I put my butter recipe in there. Now the butter recipe has, oh, it's really tasty. What I like to do is I take the lemon and I shred the lemon on the grater, okay, grate a little bit of lemon, put it inside melted butter, maybe two sticks even, 10 pound bird, I recommend that. And then also, uh, you know, chop one of the lemons in half and then squeeze the lemon, okay, so you have a lemon juice in there too. Uh, don't forget, Put some parsley in there, Italian parsley preferred. Okay, anyway, so now here we go. We got the butter sauce. You put the butter in the cavity, make sure you got a nice cavity in there. This keeps the breast warm, uh, moist. Okay, and then you take the rest of the butter and you put the rest of the butter on the skin. Okay, you get that in there and that's gonna give you a nice crispy skin at the end. Back to flat earth. Okay, and now another thing that I don't understand about these idiots out there that keep saying that, you know, flat earth is uh, dead. Oh, it's dead? Well, that's funny. Because didn't, wouldn't popular science just do an eight-page spread on it? <laughs> I used to be in advertising about 10, 15 years ago. An eight-page spread, even though you own the magazine, is like a $6,000, $10,000 ad. I mean, we couldn't, we couldn't get more advertising for free. Don't you see this? Don't you see this? Google is now going to kill all of our channels in one shot. Google wouldn't do that if it didn't know what it was doing. And people were worried about um, 
you know, the lies that are coming, you know, like a little white lie that they say, you know, like, uh, yeah, lie about their color of their car or something like that or, or something like that. And, and uh, meanwhile, the lie is, is real. The lie is right here. The lie is making 90% of the people believe that we live on a fucking planet, that we're in a solar system, that we're in space. Now, guys, I'm not saying lie to your spouse, okay? Don't say, you know, I don't want to hear anybody saying, standing up, you know, well, I was just standing there, honey, and then all of a sudden, I don't know, her mouth was open, and my dick got in there. Oh! Back to the turkey recipe. Now, the turkey recipe, this becomes a little mathematics you're going to have to use. you got to take the poundage of the turkey and then use it for um, the, uh, I'm running out of time. Shit, damn it! Oh, this sucks. This was going good. So nice. Fucked it up. Ran out of time. This sucks. All right, guys. Th I thank you for subbing. I thank you for viewing my videos. I will finish this this weekend.